Hi and welcome to Atomic Reviews. I'm your host Matthew and on this channel we review, we, I review darts, darts related materials and other items I think the darting community should know about. Today we are taking a look at the newer, I say newer because they've been out for a few weeks, but it's the new 80% Rob Cross Barrel by Target Darts. Alright, let's go ahead and get into this. All right, so today we are taking a look at the Rob Cross 80% Tungsten Barrel. Uh, of course, uh, Rob is the current world champion. Hasn't had the greatest year. Hasn't done horrible. Um, here's my, I'm gonna step on a, I don't know, I'm gonna go off script here, I guess. You know, we'll talk. Here's my thing with Rob. I love Rob, by the way. I think his story is phenomenal. I'm a home inspector by trade. So have an electrician that did this and, you know, basically world champion. I mean, that's awesome. He did really well the last couple of years. He won the world champion and I, I think at first it was way more than anticipated. I don't think he really thought going in to that tournament that he was going to win. I honestly don't think that when he went up against MVG that he thought he was going to win, but the door opened. And he stepped in and he took took it, took it to MVG and was able to pull that out. And that just propelled him. And I think the beginning of the year just hammered him hard. All that he was dealing with, the amount that he was dealing with. And he has seemed to have gotten used to it. He's gotten used to the fact that people are all pissed off that he won it. But then at the same time, there's the group of people that are pissed off that he's not doing really well because he's the world champion. Um, I think he's, he's realized that you know, not allowing what people say to affect him. Uh, I think you think you know how to deal with that and then you do something like the World Championship and blank. Anyway, so I think he's doing much better and I think coming into, um, you know, playing at the Alley Pally, he might, he might just come into his own at that point. We'll see. We'll see. Um, yeah, we'll see. That's all I'm gonna say. But let's get into this this dart. So, all right, with all that said about Rob, what we're gonna do here is I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and we'll get some pictures of them up close so you guys can see what they're like. We'll take them over to the board, I'll throw them a little, and then give you guys a just review of how I feel they threw, how I feel they feel. That's really weird. But anyway, let's get into it. I am gonna say just right off the bat, if you can see this here, this I don't know. It's not a, it's not his traditional teal. It's kind of more of an aqua color, I guess you would say. Um, it's interesting. I'm not a huge fan of the coloration. I like the teal that he's more known for, but let's see what they're like. All right, so there you have it. The Rob Cross 80% Tungsten Barrel by Target. These do come in a 22 and 24 gram in the steel tip and an 18 gram in the soft tip. A uh, slight difference here than the typical, what we've seen from Rob anyway up to this point, is this aqua color. I'm calling it an aqua color. I guess it is kind of a teal, but I'm thinking more of that dark teal color that I'm used to seeing from Rob. Anyway, uh, kind of more aqua colored. Uh, the barrel does have ringlets that run up the barrel and it is kind of more pencil shaped. So there you have it. I think it's a nice barrel. I liked throwing it, it had good feel. M grip, I'm gonna say two out of five. It's not overly grippy, but it definitely has a little bit of grip from the ringlets. So really nice barrel. They would probably wear down 
over some play uh, and be less grippy, just keep that in mind. Uh, I like what Target's done here, really nice. Uh, by the way, this little, I don't know, dart holder comes in the box. That's what I got to say about that. So there you have it, the 80% tungsten Rob Cross barrel. Thank you for watching Atomic Reviews. Again, I'm your host, Matthew. And don't forget to like and share and smash the bell. You'll know whenever we post a new review. Thanks, and we'll see you on the next one. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks. I'll see you on the next one. Thank <laughs> you.